Okay, today let's figure out how to pick random numbers. It's not complicated at all, and let me show you how. There are two ways to do it. You can let a computer do it, or you can get it from a table. Computers do it for you all the time. You can get calculators with an R&D button, or you know, if you ever played slot machines, the new electronic ones, they're just big random number generators is what they are. But let's try and get it from a table. Now, your procedure as follows. You take your finger, kind of close your eyes, and you roll your finger over the whole table, and you let it drop somewhere in this table. We're picking numbers from 1 to 75. Let's, that's what we're going to try to do. Let's say we ended up right there. Okay, so you fell on that 2. Since we're picking numbers from 1 to 75, we'll pick them two at a time. That means your first number is 25. Then go over to the next number in your table, which would be the 0, 07. Your next number is 80, uh, 0, uh, 0, 07. All well and good. The next one, you'll have to go over a couple of columns. You get an 8 and an 8. Can't use it. It's too big. We only wanted numbers from 1 to 75, as you see here. So we skip 88. The next one over is 61. Let's put that down. Your next one would be 29. Let's put that down. Now your next one, if you keep going, is 61. Can we use a duplicate? It all depends if you're picking with replacement or without replacement. With replacement means you pick a number out of a, out of a bowl, you look at it, and then you throw the number back in the bowl and you could pick the same number again. If we're picking with replacement, we would accept the 61. If we're picking without replacement, we'd have to go on to the next number, which in this case is 49. And that's how you pick random numbers.